So today I'm reacting to Bleach, woo! As you notice, there is a brand new channel intro, which I am super excited. It's kind of like a mixed anime intro that I'm going to use on every video. Besides One Piece, I have a special intro being made for One Piece, but I just wanted a mix of the animes that I love. Now, this amazing intro was made by Marimo, Oluk, and Tom. I will put all of their social medias in the description, but I was just really happy with how it turned out. The music for my intro was also by Steezy Mask and then I had MJTV do the very beginning. It was number one Bleach. He did kind of like a mix beat for that song. So it just turned out so amazing. And then I went through and I put all the sound effects together and just how it came together as a whole was amazing. So I'm really excited that I finally get to share it with you guys on my channel. But overall, again, a huge thank you to Marimo and his team for creating this awesome intro. I'm just so happy. <laughs> Anyways, today I'm pretty sure I was told this is like the wrap up. I don't know what's up with episode 340 I think it was 342 but I'm not gonna skip ahead to that one I was told to do 308 309 and 310 and then I'll kind of just watch the other stuff but I think I'm gonna go back and watch the filler arc that I missed because it was put in between Ichigo versus Yukiura. So I think before I continue on, I'm going to go back and watch that arc. I'm not 100% sure, but we ended off with Aizen actually transforming again, and now he's the butterfly. <laughs> that was crazy though, that Gein turned around and attacked Aizen. Like, that was so shocking. Just how he was coming off with Matsumoto, I was kind of like, like, I don't know, he's being a little nice to her, but then he ended up killing her. I don't know, is she actually dead? After him going at Aizen like that, I really feel like she's not dead now. But he couldn't even sense her, so I don't know what he did exactly. I don't even know what to expect in this episode. We still have to wait for Ichigo to come back, so... Like, Gein just got cut in half. Is he gonna be alive? I don't think so. Uh, I'm pretty sure we're gonna start off this episode and find out that he's actually dead. So anyways, before I get started with this reaction, I just wanted to give a huge shout out to my patrons, King of the Pirates and Above Tier. Thank you guys so much for all your love and support, not only on Patreon, but also on YouTube, just supporting my content, subscribing, commenting, like you guys are amazing. So thank you so much, Sparkles. Okay, so going to get the finale, if I'm gonna make any predictions, I mean, if Ichigo's going to come back, it's three episodes though. I don't, how are they gonna wrap this up? I honestly feel like, Ichigo might not get there in time, but I don't see him destroying everything either because there's still more bleach left. <laughs> Another thing too, because I said I got a new microphone, but then I didn't order the cords, so I'm still using my current microphone, sadly. I said summer. <laughs> It'll be okay. But yeah, so time to see the outcome of this fight. What's gonna happen? What's gonna happen to Gein? What's gonna happen to Ichigo's friends? We will find out, but let's go, bleach. Okay, so he didn't cut him in half completely. He slashed him. Now, because of the manga censoring, I wonder if he actually was cut in half at that moment, though. So he's saying he's not like worthy enough because of what he's done to say I love you to s someone? Oh! Oh my gosh, she's alive! Oh, I knew it! I knew he didn't kill her. Well, I guess I was uncertain about it. Oh, he's reaching for it. Oh no. Oh, that smirk! <gasps> Do 
He was already going down, Aizen. Jeez. What a great way to thank someone, jeez. Oh no, we're gonna get some backstory. Mm. Aww. Oh. Oh my gosh, what's happening? Oh no. Do Aizen, I swear. <gasps> oh my gosh, did she go? Oh, police say he's gonna be okay though. Oh my gosh, that was sad. <laughs> Dude, his arm. She's just coming in holding his dad. <laughs> oh. Okay, before the Bleach, like, moment picks up, there's just something about the music in Bleach, like, oh my gosh, that was so sad. There was, like, no words, but just seeing Matsumoto's face, <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm, like, trying not to tear up, but that was actually sad. Like, that's the thing about Bleach, they have such powerful music, like, that made that moment so emotional, and just him saying, like, I'm so glad that I apologized, and I'm sorry, and just... Oh, when anime does that, when they just have that powerful music and it's like silence, it's so, the, just the entire scene as a whole is so impactful and so emotional. Oh, and then Ichigo shows up. It's like, they keep like making my emotions go in a roller coaster. Oh my gosh. That was sad though. That hit me a little bit there. And then it's like, epic, Ichigo's here. <laughs> Oh, he does look different! I didn't even notice that! <laughs> it's probably from all the time that's passed in there. Ichigo gotta look now. Dude, Ichigo looks so freaking sexy right now. I mean, he always did. And he doesn't know his name, does he? <laughs> I've been waiting for this moment forever. I want to see Aizen just like have a complete breakdown. Ichigo, let's do this! <laughs> Maybe he just has too much that you can't notice it? I'm assuming he did that because of his friends around. Uh, let's be real though, Aizen. You're cheating with that thing. Is he gonna transform again? What's happening? Oh! Oh. 
Oh, here we go! Here we go! Damn! Is this blade different? I can't tell. It looks different. Is it Mpaktu? Yeah, what the heck? It's like... Woo. <laughs> Aizen just coming down like that. <laughs> oh, look at that. It's not gonna work, is it? <laughs> oh my gosh, he did it! He stopped it with his hand! Okay, I need to breathe. <laughs> Someone's in denial. <laughs> Miracles happen like that from time to time. I really feel like we're going to get Aizen's breakdown. He's going all out. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Again, keep your cool Ichigo because that's the one thing Aizen probably hates the most. Oh, wipe that smug look off his face. Oh, oh the lag! That was like the worst lagging. <laughs> oh man, this is just so satisfying to watch. Was he gonna say that was? Oh! <laughs> Whoa! This episode, though, wow! Just the entire build-up of every single arc, and Aizen always thinking that he is one step above everyone. That was probably <laughs> one of the most satisfying things to see. He's like, Ichigo, you can't comprehend this. Like, muhaha. And then Ichigo just comes in like, swipe. This is amazing, though. Just seeing the look on Aizen's face is so good. Oh my gosh. I love it. I loved everything about this episode except the beginning with Gein. I'm pretty sure he's gonna die there just because he said he can die now, seeing how powerful Ichigo has become. I didn't even notice that at first, so, well, obviously, he spent a lot of time training, and in the real world, it, you know, time was going slower, so Ichigo came out a different person. Ichigo is a strong dude now. He is not faced by anything Aizen saying. He's just looking at him with his eyes and his sexy hair, and he's like, Here I come, Aizen. <laughs> it's great, though, this entire episode. Oh my gosh. When he, I think one of my favorite moments, though, from that episode is where he caught Aizen's blade. Because we remember the first time Ichigo charged at Aizen, and Aizen stopped it with his hand. I think it was his finger, like, I think it was a finger. Was it a finger or a hand? I can't exactly remember, but Aizen did stop Ichigo's attack. And then the background music just cut out. That was one of the most iconic moments, though, when Ichigo first ran to Aizen and he was attacking him, and Aizen stopped his attack, and also the background music. Like, that was amazing, but oh my gosh, here we go. I'm so excited. I'm wondering, though, in this fight, are we gonna get a moment where the tables turn, or is Ichigo just going to dominate Aizen? Oh my gosh. Oh, so good. So good. Oh my gosh. I love it. 309. Here we come. Oh.
Really? Darn it. Oh, he still was cut. Oh. He's losing it. He's losing it. Oh. Ew. Ew. What the heck? Oh, what the? What is happening? Oh my gosh. Oh! What the heck just happened? Is he being like possessed by that thing now? Oh! What the? Isaac? What the heck? Is that supposed to be blood? Okay. And time for the final boss fight. <laughs> when the boss evolves. <laughs> what the heck? That was insane. Okay, he's not making any noise. He's just taking all these attacks, so. Oh my gosh, he's really good with these comebacks, though. <gasps> oh my gosh, here we go. Is it over now? Is this gonna be it? Aizen is not even Aizen anymore. Just finish him. Interesting way. Is this gonna like kill him or something? I wanna see what he's gonna look like. Oh! What the f What? His hair is black!
it's so gross how his skin's like peeling off. Oh my gosh, here we go! Dude! His eyes! Aww. This is sad though, what he's sacrificing just to use this, but... <gasps> oh! No! He said goodbye to him! ground So is Ichiko going to look like that now? <laughs> Are you kidding? Oh. Ooh. There you go. Ichigo's goes back to normal. Oh no. No, because he doesn't have his powers anymore. Oh no. This is horrible. Oh my gosh. You are very disgusting right now, Aizen. <laughs> gonna happen to him. Oh! <gasps> oh, he's losing it! He's losing it! over. Oh my gosh. This is the end. This is the end. Soul King. Damn, Aizen. Ooh. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Like, the animation, everything is going crazy. Oh. Well, damn. <laughs> Aizen is just a prime example of corruption, of power, but he was just too smart for his own good as well. I have the chills though, whoa. <laughs> Yay. He did it! Yay! Oh, so happy for him! That was a very satisfying fight at the end. What the heck? Is Aizen just that thing now? Or is he dead? I 
Eisen, 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 Eisen. Like, damn, Eisen. That's the one thing. He makes a great villain character, but you could even see it at the end when he was losing his mind when he finally got to that moment. Because throughout this entire series, we've just seen Eisen always keeping calm, always like, well, I planned this. This was all a part of my plan. But when you see a person like Eisen who thinks that they are just the level of God, and you know what? He wasn't even using his own power, you know? So I'm just like, Eisen, no. He was way too cocky and just thinking that he was so much more intelligent, which, again, a lot of his plans were very thought out, very intelligent. Like, he was an intelligent guy. But that's what caused his downfall. Like, and Uahara talking about the Soul King and how the Soul Society will split apart without it. And Eisen's just like, that's loser talk. Like, goodbye, Eisen. That defeat, though, oh my gosh, like, I feel like the weight has just been lifted off my shoulder, because Aizen, like, okay, Aizen, again, he's a good-looking dude, but he made me so angry, like, this entire time, just his attitude just always infuriated me, so I'm just so happy. That was such a proud moment, though, seeing Ichigo come in there with confidence and defeat Aizen, so yay! <laughs> so in the next episode, I'm just gonna assume everyone's going to meet up again and get to see the aftermath of this, but wow, that, the animation in that episode, just up until the very end, before Aizen was killed, was just amazing. I'm just, wow, that was amazing! What the heck? <laughs> now it's over! <laughs> Oh my gosh, that was a great episode. I loved it. I don't know if this is just me thinking too much into it, but right before Aizen was actually killed, like, it looked like he was kind of put in a straight jacket. Like, that's just how it looked. Like, his arms were just put together and it was just covering his entire body. And when I looked at him, I'm like, this guy, he's crazy and he's in a straight jacket. Like, that's what I got out of that. I don't know if that's what they tried to make it look like, but yeah. Basically, seeing someone calm and collective like Aizen lose it. So, good job, Leech. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna do one more episode, so let's go. Okay, so we're just getting to the... So really... <laughs> Literally thought he was just gonna do that. Oh my god. <laughs> Aww. Such a cute little moment. 310. Lighthearted. But oh my gosh. Whew, that last one was intense. Now Ichigo is not. He doesn't have his Shinigami powers anymore. Okay, so we haven't seen Nell yet. What is that noise? Huh. It's the dog! Right? That's the same dog that... I think he was the one that was carrying it. But we're so cute! Don't hurt it. It's just a happy little doggy. Of course they want to. They probably want to make sure. Oh. He's like so cute. Now he can actually talk to his friends and they won't feel like he's just like leaving them out of everything. Oh, he's not dead? あいつの刀にはああ。あいつの力がずっと自分と同じ目線に立ってくれる誰かを探してたんじゃねえのかな。あいつはずっと心のどこかでただの死神になりたいと願ってたんじゃねえのかな。Wow, okay. <laughs> Dang. Makes me feel a little bad. <gasps> oh, 
do grab her, kiss her. Oh my gosh, everyone's there. Aww. Aww, that's so cute. Aww. Oh! He needs to rest. Oh! Oh no. What the heck's happening? Oh, he's okay. He's okay. Now two of my husbandos are in prison. No! <laughs> Oh my gosh. Damn! What are the odds? <laughs> I feel like putting him in prison is not a good idea. <laughs> I can't believe it! He's alive though! When Uehara said that like they were going to trial him, I was thinking we were gonna see his little like seal thing, but no, like Aizen, there he is. Aizen was basically strapped down in every possible way. I don't know though, putting someone like Aizen in a prison sounds like a horrible idea. Like he's a smart dude. I feel like that's not a great idea, but, but what does this mean for like the future? だ、Everyone's training. Gosh. This is sad. Oh. so sad that he's oh, I can't believe it uh. okay what the heck happened to him do you just have like a muscle spasm or something or cramp <laughs> That's just like one of the side effects. Oh. 
Oh, it is. No. This is just depressing. And you. No, that's so sad. Oh, okay. So it can happen during a lar like a long period of time. So I feel like he's doomed to just lose it by the end of the leech, you know. That's it. Makes me sad. It's like out of all the people. Aww. They're such good friends. Now they're gonna have a party. <laughs> wow, that is that's so depressing to me, even though he's okay with it and he accepts it. Oh sad. Did all of the arcs? I don't think all the arcs ended like that, though. Weird. I don't think I've ever seen, like, the Iran cards. Wow! Uh, just wow. Okay, so knowing that there's another arc of Bleach coming next year, I think, or the year after, I'm not sure when it's actually coming back. Like, in my head, I'm thinking, okay, like, Ichigo lost his powers. What's he going to do? But he hasn't lost them yet, and it could be months, it could be years. When that time comes, though, it's gonna be so heartbreaking because, like, that's a big part of Ichigo. That's a big part of his story, and he's come to accept it because, I mean, to be fair, he knew what was gonna happen. That hurts me just when he was talking about it. Matsumoto with Gin though, like, I feel so bad for her. And she was just kind of walking around like, oh, everyone's moving on. That's sad. That's really sad. Oh, that hurt my soul. And I can't believe it. This arc's over. It's like, there's still more bleach though. So I'm happy about that. But this was like a really great arc. Like we had so many good fights. Now haven't seen her yet. Still wondering where the heck she went. <laughs> Like, really? I thought maybe in this episode we would get to see her, but we got some awesome fights. So, like, Ichigo versus Grimjo, Yukiora versus Ichigo. Then we got Ichigo versus Aizen, and Aizen's still alive. He's gonna spend his time in prison, so another husbando in prison, it seems. <laughs> I don't know exactly. I think I will start, like, I'll go backwards and I'll start the arc that I just missed because I think that was like 60 episodes. I'm not really sure, especially with Bleach coming back because then I can just, like, continue on and then hopefully it won't be, like, the end of next year because that would be insane. I do plan on watching all the Bleach movies and then the filler arcs that I missed and I don't know if I'm gonna necessarily go back to the few filler, like, episodes. I don't think I really skipped much. It's just mostly the filler arcs which I skipped. So, yeah, I'm really excited to continue on my bleach journey and that was just crazy those episodes were great and I'm glad I like paired them together because it fit very nicely thank you guys so much for checking out my bleach reaction if you like this video give it a like make sure to subscribe to my channel for more awesome bleach content and other anime things and as always I hope you all have a wonderful day stay fresh and bye